Hi. Well, I've got an interesting little gun out here today. This is a Marlin Model 1892. And these were uh, made from, uh, I believe, uh, from 1892 on up to um, maybe end of the teens. I'll have to look it up. I'll put that at, towards the end of the videos when they were made, too. This particular one was made in 1906. Chambered in 22 long rifle. It's a predecessor to the Marlin model 1897, which of course went on to uh, eventually become uh, the Marlin model 39. Pretty much the same basic design. This model 39 had several improvements and simplifications. But uh, this one's in decent shape for its age. Got a fair amount of wear on it, but it's uh, honest wear, not, uh, not been abused. I'll get this camera put on a tripod and we'll try a few shots. Okay, I got her all loaded up and we'll try a few shots. Uh, these older guns like this do have a little bit different uh, way of loading than more modern ones do. And uh, towards the end of the video, um, I'll uh, get into more detail on that and show you how some of that works. Yep, she's empty. Well, I looked up the years that these things were made, and uh, they were the Model 1892 Marlin was made from 1892 up to 1916. And as I said before, this particular one was made in 1906, and pretty decent shape for its age. Does have some wear, but it's all honest wear, not not much abuse. Let's see if we can get these markings to show up here. I don't know how well that's going to show up. But these were made in uh, 22 long rifle, and they were also made in 32 Colt. 32 long cold, I believe. But what I wanted to make sure I showed everybody here was that uh, this loading system. Now you um, normally um, a 22 with a tube magazine will have a slot here to put the ammunition in and you, you got an internal uh, rod inside of a fixed outer magazine. Now this one is kind of different. This also has two tubes but the outer tube is the one that will uh, retract. And as you can see here it's slotted and when you get this pulled out far enough The inner one is also slotted. You get it pulled out that far and then you have your um, place to insert your ammunition there. So it is somewhat different there. But the operation of it is more or less the same. And it is uh, an early variation of the Model 39. 
there's quite a few little differences that took place it change it took place in between the model 92 and the model 39 but it's plain to see the, you know where the influences came from I want to do an end of video shout out and this one's for gun collector 007 and I'll put a link to his channel in the description of the video get a chance go check it out Thanks for watching.